Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in today. And today's video topic is going to be all about eyeshadow palette formulas. Now I'm gonna be focusing specifically on matte formulas and eyeshadows that I really, really enjoy and I have five to talk about. So recently I saw some other ladies do this video and those ladies would be Heather Austin, Miss Melissa M. Beauty, and Mandy Lee. All channels that I'm subscribed to, all channels that I really, really enjoy. They're wonderful ladies and I love their content. So this was their collab video that they did. It was the three of them did it together and they just talked about their favorite eyeshadow formulas. And I saw all of their videos and some of them are same as mine, but I'm gonna go ahead and mention mine because I think that it's great to know all about the good formulas that there are out there. And so these are my top five. So hello, welcome if you're new, my name is Amy. Thanks for stopping by today. And I love all things beauty related, but I especially love eyeshadow. That's my passion, my first love. And I love eyeshadow palettes and just any eyeshadow related content in general. Doesn't matter what it is, duos, trios, quads, shades, whatever you wanna talk about, I love eyeshadow. So that's the primary topic of conversation on this channel, but I love drugstore makeup as well. And I also have some fun, let it kind of quirky little series that I like to do on my channel. So hopefully you guys will like that and you'll stick around and subscribe. If you wanna do that, go ahead and let's get started. Okay, the first eyeshadow palette formula that we're gonna talk about, and I am really focusing a lot on matte eyeshadow formulas. I can do a separate video for shimmer, but there are some good shimmer formulas in these brands that I'm gonna mention here. So we can just kinda of take that all together if we want. So. The first palette or the first brand I want to talk about is Anastasia Beverly Hills. And the example I have to show you is the Jackie Ina palette, which is a collaboration with Jackie Ina here on YouTube. She is phenomenal and she created a really awesome color story. Here it is right here. And the mattes in here are just the same good quality ABH mattes that you will find in all of their 14 color eyeshadow palettes. They're really, really soft, kind of powdery, but very pigmented and they blend out really well. So I love the ABH a matte eyeshadow formula. I love the shimmers in here too. Um, the shimmers are really soft, so you gotta be careful. Work great with a brush, work great with a finger. Um, they're very impactful, and I love ABH's shimmer formula as well. Um, some of them are more intense than others, but I just love them all in general. So I'm just gonna give this one an all around A plus just for formula in general, but these are the best palettes. I have five, five ABH palettes would have more, but uh, I don't need them all. <laughs> you know, I'm not a collector. I used to be for a long time, but I'm not so much these days, but this one I had to get. And I got this one, I think, for my birthday, this, um, or Christmas. I got this as a Christmas gift. Very great. If you have an opportunity, you might wanna pick this one up. It is limited edition, so if you like it, get it now. But in general, the ABH formula is just phenomenal. I love their matte formula. I love their shimmer formula. It's great. So what I'm really excited about in this video is, and we're gonna be talking about three, three indie brands and all of these brands have incredible matte shadows. And one of them has incredible shimmer shadows too, but specifically we're talking about the mattes. The first brand I wanna talk about is Menagerie Cosmetics. I only have one palette for Menagerie Cosmetics. This is the Feral palette. Isn't it pretty? I talked about this palette in my eyeshadow palette lovers tag video and look at the packaging. It's just stunning. and. Um, I love Menagerie Cosmetics. I want to get more of their palettes. Um, but this one is the Feral palette. These shades, when I tell you these mattes, are so creamy. I'm not even joking you. They're just absolutely stunning. My favorite color, one of my favorite purples ever, is Allium. This, I touch into this and it just feels like, it feels like silk. It's just so beautiful. And the mattes are great. I'm not as much a fan of the shimmers in the Menagerie formula and these palettes, but these mattes are everything. This yellow is great. These greens are, these these two greens are great. Um, all the matte shades are great in here. The, the teak turquoise is great. I love the matte formula in the Menagerie um, palettes and I can't say enough good things. I'm not as much, like I said, a fan of their shimmers, but their mattes are, are as Karen would say, chef's kiss. They're so good. I love them. So the next brand we're gonna talk about, and these have both a good matte and good shimmer formula, are the Kaleidos um, eyeshadow palettes. Kale Kaleidos, 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 Kaleidos um, makeup. I love Kaleidos. They just came out with two new palettes. I am probably gonna get both of them. And they're in their Futurism series, which are their six pan palettes. So let me just open this up for you guys so you can see how stunning these are. 
So this is the Astro Pink. The mattes in this are ridiculous. They have the same kind of feel to them, that really, really soft, buttery feeling that um, some of the, uh, like the Menagerie ones do. They have some kick up, but not a whole ton, but they are so pigmented and they blend so well that they're just stunning. The, the Shimmer Formula is really insane too. Love this color right here. That one's stunning. Um, the blue is stunning. The shimmers work really, really great. Um, they're very foiled and very, very metallic. So I really like the shimmer formula as well. But yes, um, the Shishimi, Shishimi, I can say that, Shishimi City and the Lunar Lavender are both on my radar. The Lunar Lavender more than the uh, Shishimi City. But I think because I have four of these already, I'm definitely going to want both of those. I just... The formula is so good. You really can't beat Kaleidos. They are so, is it Kaleidos? Kaleidos, Kaleidos, Kaleidos. I never know if I'm saying it pro properly, but I think it's Kaleidos. They're, they're so, they're so good, they're so good. So the next brand I wanna talk about, I'm wearing one of these shadows on my eyes, is Davina, Davina Cosmetics. Davina Cosmetics, I have a set I have a, a set of mattes and then I got a set and a give, you know, a group of shadows in a giveaway. Their shimmer formula is pretty darn amazing too, but I'm specifically talking about the mattes here. I have this shade, which is called Suki, the shade right here. I have that shade on my, in my crease and transition, and it's so good. These shadows are a little, are a little bit powdery, not too bad, not as powdery as AB8 shadows, but so pigmented and I cannot tell you how easily they blend. These are probably the most blendable um, mattes that I have. Um, they build up nicely. I can, I got, I got a really, really intense, you know, good build out of this. It started out with a nice light wash, and it can be kind of a nice lavender, but you can really build it up to that, you know, that mauvey, dusty uh, purple. It's very, very beautiful. So I have another shadow on my outer corner um, that's a little bit deeper than this, and that's going to be my next formula. But the Divina, the Divina singles are everything the matte shades are everything the matte shadows i love them so so much highly recommend davina um eyeshadows i wonder if she's ever going to do palettes i hope she does palettes soon because i think more people will be apt to try her formula you're gonna go in your room you want to come say hi real quick come say hi come here come say hi sorry she wasn't feeling it today I was hoping to get her on camera, but anyway, she just got home and um, she's watching her iPad now. So that was Delilah. And for those of you who do not know, I have a 10 year old daughter named Delilah and she's a character. So anyway, the last matte formula that I want to talk about comes from the BH Cosmetics Zodiac eyeshadow palettes. This is the original Zodiac um, palette and I love the matte shadows in these palettes they are so so good and so pigmented and blend so well like you're you would not you would not believe it now i like bh uh, cosmetics eyeshadows in general but there's something really really unique and special about the matte eyeshadows in these palettes especially the purples like you hear stories about how how bad purples can be or how difficult they can be to formulate these are so good like you would never know that they that purple is a different color difficult color i have this shade right here and i think this is the taurus matte i can't i don't have my glasses on but i think this is the taurus matte yeah taurus matte and it's a deep eggplant color super pretty i have that on my outer corner um and i absolutely love these mattes I, these palettes are huge i know that they're big but i'm telling you you can get so much mileage out of these and you would not be disappointed with the matte shadows in here. The baked shadows are beautiful too. You do have to wet them, but you do get a lot of impact and, and really nice um, shine and glow with the uh, shimmer shadows as well as the baked shimmers. Um, but the mattes are where it's at. The mattes are everything in this formula. And you know, and it's across the board because I have the three large Zodiac palettes, the three larger ones. Um, the Love Signs and the Crystal Zodiac as well. And the formula in those matte shades is the same across the board. They all work the same. It's the same exact formula. So I think I'm just going to say the Zodiac palettes formula for the mattes is stunning. So 
I hope you guys enjoyed my version of this video and that you learned something new about some eyeshadow formulas you've never tried before or that you were interested in trying. And um, yeah, what is your favorite um, eyeshadow formula? Did I mention it in this video or do you have a different one that you think I need to get on board with? I would love to hear that in the comments down below and thanks so much for watching. Now if you guys liked my video, do be sure to give me a thumbs up and um, let me know you liked it and also subscribe if you want to. The button's right there. You can subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you're informed of when I post future videos. Thank you for tuning in today, you guys. I was happy to have you here. Hope you have a good day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.